Now why would somebody break a handrail on a footbridge? Well, good afternoon folks. It's uh, Saturday the 18th of May and I'm back on Dartmoor. Uh, I ain't decided to come up this weekend. I was going to do next bank holiday, which is next weekend. I may do it again, but uh, a mate of mine, that's uh, Coral, uh, so it's got a YouTube channel, Dead Fall Out Door, so I'm going to have a look at it. Uh, I work with a bloke anyway, but he's up here this weekend. So we have uh, kind of arranged for a bit of a YouTube meetup, which means probably a load of talking and a load of drinking. So I'm going to press on now, and I'll catch you in a bit. Get off my patch! <laughs> uh, that damn cuckoo's following me up the valley. Anyway, I've pitched up my usual place. Uh, it's looking alright. And right with me is Coral from Dead Four Outdoors. Afternoon, Coral. Afternoon. And he's got the MLD Trail Star, is it? Yep. Looks alright. Yeah, it matches my shirt, which is brown. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, anyway, I've got to get my water done and I'll have some tea now and uh, I'll catch you all up later on. Right, I've just started doing my tea. Naturally, I have a tin of Spam, which is uh, frying away very nicely there. And I look across and see Coral, and he's frying some Spam as well. Yeah, we're having a Spam off. Yeah, Spam off. I think I said that right. But uh, if I get a bit more hungry, I've got some eggs with me as well and quite a bit of other food, but I'll show you that later on. So I'm going to enjoy this now, and I'll catch you all in a bit. All right, I've just had two Spam and cheese sandwiches. So I've just done some more Spam and a fried egg. And that is a fried egg, all right? Trust me, because there's the eggshell. But uh, it looks pretty good. I've got Cora over here laughing his head off, thinking I'm going to get food poisoning now, which I probably will. So I'm going to tug into this, and if I don't do any more filming, you know I'm ill. Uh, good morning folks, it's 8 o'clock now, uh, sun's up, it's a bit of a fresh wind but at least it's dry. So uh, I slept okay last night, apart from Carl snoring most of the night. And uh, the shower, yeah, I set up slightly different than yesterday and it's held up quite well so I think I'll do that technique from now on. So I'm going to head back down, get some breakfast on the go and then I'll pack up and I'll press on from there. Uh, so I'll do my breakfast guys and there you go, Spam and fried egg sandwich for breakfast. And you can't beat that can you? Uh, unless you've got two of them. Right, all mine, I'm going to enjoy this. Alright, it's gone 10 o'clock now, I'm all packed up. I've just checked the grey, make sure I've left nothing behind. And all my rubbish is picked up. So, Carl's unpacked all his gear away, and uh, he's going to head off now. And I'm going to head off, so... I'll catch you all guys later, and Carl, get off my patch. <laughs> well, there goes Carl. He's heading on his way up to Kitty Tour up there. And, uh, I told him not to get lost, but, uh somebody wearing a bright orange coat like that I don't think it'll get lost so uh, yeah it's been good fun last night so I'm now going to press on up head towards Dinger Tor which is off to the right just around the corner here and I'll take it from there Yeah, I've just stopped off in this dip here for a few minutes and something to drink. I walked from Dinger Tour and I've come down a track and I'm just below East Mill Tour which is up there and you've got Yes Tour right in the distance. So I'm just going to head up up this way here in a minute and go towards Oak Tour and take it from there. I'm now on the brow of the hill, that's a, an observation post there. Uh, right in front of me is Steeperton Tour but I'm going to turn to my left now and follow this track down and go towards Oak Tour and have my lunch there I think and then I'll probably go up towards Bellstone. I'm currently on Oak Tour I've decided to stop here now and have something to eat so uh, stove's on the go I've got some water boiling and for my lunch I've got a, a mug shop and if I'm still hungry I've got some cheddar biscuits which are bacon flavour and a little pack of cheese to go with it so Water's come up to a boil now, and I'll have that, and then I'll probably stop and do some time lapse photography here for a while, and then probably press on and go up towards Bellstone.
Right, currently on Bellstone tour, Bellstone Common, where it's called. Uh, just been doing some time lapse photography. Now, down in the valley in front of me, I'll just point something out. That's Steeperton tour, and that on the right is Oak tour. But roughly in the center of the frame, what looks to me like a car. And I'll gradually zoom in and let you make your own mind up. That to me looks like a car, possibly something like a Suzuki Vitara or something, but you can make out the headlights, you can see the wheel arches, you can probably make out what looks like a wing mirror and a windscreen. But how the hell did that get down there? Uh, I've just come down from Bellstone Tour now and I'm stopped down in this valley. And I've just made myself a brew, I've got a cup of tea there. And I'm gonna have a quick snack now, I've got some of those cheddar biscuits left and some of that cheese. So I'm gonna enjoy that. All right, I'm now heading off the moors. So uh, thanks for watching. If you like this one, give us a thumbs up. If you're not already a subscriber, click the old subscribe button down below. I'll try to leave a link to Coral's channel, which is Dead for White Doors, somewhere in the description. And if you've got any questions or comments, please leave them in the comments box and I'll get back to you. So for me, I'll see you all again soon.